today, yes, I'm going to do a, or attempt to do a string pour. I'm using a really cheap and small canvas because I'm not sure how this is going to work. This will be the first attempt ever. Um, so we'll see how it goes. Hopefully it's better than the last couple of ones I've done. I have not been happy with my ring pours. So I think so far my favorite technique is the flip and drag or just the regular flip cup. Um, I don't know if those seem to give me the best result so far. Um, so that may be the technique I stick with for the most part. So I'm just covering my canvas with my white, I get my base down. Um, all of my paints are mixed with Floetrol and water. Um, so I do add some of the Liquitex pouring medium also to my paints. Oftentimes, um, so there's that. White is really thin, so let's get into the bottom of my bottle. I think I'm gonna have to mix them up soon. I thought I was going to get one more use out of these gloves, but I'm not because they're flaking stuff onto my paint. So, I'm going to put a new pair of gloves on. I may actually do this without gloves. <clears throat> I'll torch this a little bit since there's. Okay. Bubbles. So, yeah, my torch is too high. I have a huge project due for grad school this weekend. But of course, my printer is out of ink and I need to be able to print some stuff in order to work on some. So, that's great. Make sure you okay. You can see my red. So I'm gonna just take a picture of the paints I use and post that with the video. Um, most of these paints have silicone in them. Um, I also reuse my popsicle sticks. I just let them dry out and then I use the wrong end. So I'm gonna do green first. But the green that I'm using is apple orchard. I think I'm going to go with my favorite, which is the Apple Barrel Turquoise. I don't know. I really like this color. Um, I did the a couple of the ones that I've posted already. I just really like the way this turns out. Um, this is just a pretty color. So, just see here. Watch several videos on string pulls, but this is my first actual attempt. So um, I'm going to do it with my string doubled up. I did watch one today where the string was doubled up, and I'll kind of show y'all the technique that she used. Hopefully, I'll be able to. Uh, duplicate what she did. We'll see. I don't know. And I can't remember the name of the lady that did it, but I will look. I'm probably blocking the camera doing that. And try and put it in the description also. Uh, 
Alright, here goes nothing. <clears throat> oh, you can already see cells, that's kind of cool. So I think the key is to doing this slowly. She did it where she kind of pulled it down. Like that so far. I think maybe this will be better without silicone, but we shall see. I'm gonna try the green. My apple orchard. Um, this plastic tray I'm using is actually just a tray that I got from the dollar store for a dollar. Go figure. Um, look at the cells. So I use it when I'm doing my regular acrylic painting and um, so I figured I mix my paints for my regular acrylic paintings that I use a brush on um, on this so it washes off really easily. Um, I think that's kind of why I like it. I'm all about trying to use things that aren't wasteful for several reasons. I don't want to have to buy a whole ton of um, cups and things like that if I don't have to. If I can reuse them, then that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to let that sit for a minute and then I'm going to stir up some of my pink and um, while the pink string is soaking, I will pull that one I'll try and get kind of a system going. So I'm in grad school for social work. I think anyone who knows me knows that I am a therapist and I work with adolescents. Um, I have been a therapist for going on seven years now. Um, so I have to do a lot of self-care where I take care of myself so that I'm healthy enough to take care of other people. And this is part of my self-care. Yeah, I think doing this without silicone is probably going to be a good idea. <clears throat> but I'm still digging this. So, let's see how I'm going to do. Hmm, since I dropped the pink over there. Hey, it looks like the breast cancer thing. It was not intentional, but I still like it. I may turn my canvas around here in a second and do some from the other side, but I'm going to keep doing it this way for a minute. There's a fly in here. So yeah, I work with adolescents who are in treatment for um, drugs and alcohol. Usually they don't want to be there. Usually they're forced by their families. Um, man, there's a lot of lacing going on. That's really cool. So, 
um, <laughs> but usually by the time they leave, they've realized that, okay, they're in the right place and their parents aren't completely crazy. It's just a, a lot of stress, you know, some of the kids I work with have some pretty rough histories. I mean, I don't know. It's just hard hearing kids' stories and the struggles they've gone through and, um, yeah. Alright, let's see how this turned out. But I definitely enjoy my job. If I didn't, I wouldn't have been doing it for as many years as I have. Mm -hmm. I like to do fun art projects with the kids. And I'm fortunate to work for a an institution that supports that. Uh, <clears throat> One more color. So far, so good, y'all. I don't hate it. And the tree ring pours I've done the past couple of nights, I pretty much hate it. Um, I mean, they don't look horrible. They just didn't turn out the way I pictured in my head, which is, you know, I'm kind of a perfectionist, so if things don't turn out exactly as I think they should, then... I'm just, I don't like it, you know. I guess most people are like that. So you probably, this is probably out of frame. But. I'm going to actually make sure that all these are covered again. I'm probably going to use... Y'all can hear my dogs, our dogs. We have four dogs. Um, a German Shepherd, a Shih Tzu, a Dalmatian, and a Toy Poodle. Um, the German Shepherd's a puppy. He's only about... I guess it's probably seven months now, maybe. Um, that is the Dalmatian probably barking at the German Shepherd because the Dalmatian is older and the alpha dog and yeah, so he's kind of grouchy sometimes. You really like that. Okay. I haven't even torched at all. I mean, look at all these cells. Um, I'll zoom y'all in in a minute. And then I all, well, I've started trying to post pictures of the pour when it's dry at the end of the videos. So. Um, when this is dry, I will post these pictures. I'm actually going to walk
So I think the next time I do one of these, I'm not, I'm going to make sure the paint don't, doesn't have silicone because I, although I like this, I think that if it did not have silicone, it would be a completely different kind of effect. Okay. So I am I'm going to turn it. Hopefully. And I'm going to do some of this turquoise over here on top of the pink and see how that works out. But I may, well, let's see what I can do. This could be the end of this. We'll see. I don't know why I keep doing the pink cross. I'm going to uncross it. Oh, I like that. That's cool. I feel like it's all too separate. So I'm going to, hmm. What am I going to do? I think. Take this one. I can't put this stick back in there because it's got more than one color on there. Almost did. Okay. 
I like that. Kind of broke everything up a little bit. Okay. So I think I may do the same with this one. Go this direction. And then I'm going to torch and then I'm going to leave it alone, I think. That was neat. Okay. Hmm. Now I got a big white spot there. Purple. I haven't done purple. <laughs> well, I have, but I haven't done it like the third time. So we're going to put that in here. So even though this is a string pull, it doesn't look like a traditional string pull because of all the silicone. Okay, torch. There's a lot of stuff happening over here now. I think I like it. So... mistake probably but hmm. there's a couple of like empty spots so the whole thing where I said I wasn't going to do anything else. I lied. Hmm. Now 
can't see on that. Nope. I'm gonna leave it except for. So these are bamboo skewers, um, which are pretty cool. Like a hundred of them at the dollar store, so. I really like this ribbon type thing going on. I'm pretty happy with this in general. I'm pretty happy with this, but I'm going to mess with it some more. Okay. Seriously. Stopping after I torch. 